am Lauren Weilerman, creator of Wildflowers Nails. Today I have an exciting tutorial. It's one stroke, and I don't know if you've attempted one stroke. Maybe you suck at it. Uh, but I really think that you could fall in love with one stroke if you have the right tools. It helps a lot to have the right paint and the right brushes. And when you have those things, it becomes really fun and really easy to do one stroke. So uh, for today's tutorial, I'm using the Wildflowers Light Pink Brush and I'll be using the Wildflowers Butter Pants. Now, our butter pants are so great. This is what was really a game changer for me. These paints have about three times as much pigment as craft store paint does. So they're much easier to do one stroke on nails with. They're also made with pigments that are approved for use in cosmetics, which is important when you're a nail professional. So um, if you haven't tried one stroke, Give it a shot today. If you love it, this month's No Show Nail Academy, I'll be teaching you how to do a rose using the one stroke technique. So you can check that out. There'll be a link below. Make sure you comment, uh, make sure you try the nail, and if you do try it, make sure you tag us. Hashtag Wildflower Snails. Thanks for watching. Here is the finished nail. It's pretty simple and I think it's fun and easy. You wanna also have the Wildflowers matte top coat and the Wildflowers top coat gel to protect the design when you're finished. All right, the first thing I'll do is apply my gel polish color. Now I chose a color in the same range as the butter paints that I'm using. And then you want to coat this with a matte top coat. It's a lot easier to do one stroke on top of a matte nail because the brush has really good drag to it and you get good traction. I'm gonna be using the butter paints in violet and white and I'm using the light pink brush. I'm applying the white on the toe of the brush, which is the longer part, and I'm applying the violet on the heel of the brush. Now, you wanna really work these colors into your brush and blend them well before you ever move over to the nail. Once you get over to the nail, you're going to place your brush down and kind of aim for the corner. And remember that one stroke isn't called one stroke because it's done in one stroke. They call it one stroke because you're applying two colors in one stroke. So that means you have complete freedom to do your uh, strokes in multiple strokes. And if you screw it up, just wait for it to dry and you can paint right over top of it. So as you can see, most of the time it takes me, you know, two times to get my stroke nice and perfect the way I want it. And I go back to that same place on my mat to blend my colors again and again. So I'm just crisscrossing over, lining them up as I do it so that they cross over perfectly. And that's pretty much that. There's not a whole lot to it. Just perfecting it, make sure it's completely dry before you apply your top coat. So I'm going to use the Wildflowers Top Coat Gel, coat over this, cure it, and that's that. Now, I want you to notice that's acetone right off of my mat. I love my art mat. If you're ready to move on to more advanced things, here is the No Show Nail Academy for this month. You can find a link in the description below that will take you straight there. Don't forget our website is wildflowersnails.com. You can go there and find a pathway to anywhere you wanna go. We have in-person workshops, we have online courses, and all sorts of goodies. Now our big class is coming up in about two weeks. It is the Master Artist Week. We have uh, nail techs coming from all across the world to come to this in-person course. I'll also be doing courses throughout the United States, so just visit wildflowersnails.com if you want to check those out. We will be listing our next Master Artist Week on our website very soon. The one we're having in two weeks, I believe, is about sold out. We may have one spot left in class. So if you're interested and you're local, hurry up and sign up or get your travel arrangements made. I hope to see you all. I hope to teach you all at some point in your nail career. I would love nothing more. And don't forget to check out our classes online. Again, these brushes you can get online anytime at wildflowersnails.com. And be sure to subscribe for a tutorial every Thursday. Thanks for watching.